now, your WLKY weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Cardosi. Oh my goodness, some baseball weather out there on this Tuesday late afternoon. My goodness, it continues to be absolutely wonderful across the region pretty much all afternoon. Temperatures nice and warm, a good dose of sunshine. Late last night, earlier this morning, we actually had a couple of sprinkles reported from town and points off to the north. Had a trace of a little bit of light rain shower activity in the metro. Otherwise, eh, the big story was just the wonderful condition. 71 degrees, top temperature, morning start of 52. Right now, as warm as it's been all day, 71 degrees, humidity nice and low, a west breeze in here at 10 miles per hour. Other temperatures, top to bottom, we're talking about plenty of middle to upper 60s to that warmer 71 right here in the downtown region and just a very slow drop on the way the next several hours. Any plans you have outdoors, that jog around the block, grilling out, yeah, go for it, it looks wonderful. Weather conditions remain very quiet across the two-state region, just a couple of clouds every so often. We'll go from 67 at 7 down into the upper 50s by late this evening with clear to partly cloudy skies. Now, when you wake up in the morning, it will be dry. Again, we'll have clear to partly cloudy conditions. Those temperatures cool. We're back in the low and middle 40s for the most part as we're looking at 45 in the city. The thing about tomorrow, a system is going to graze us from the south and also the southwest. So the clouds will be increasing late morning, especially through the afternoon. And I think south of the metro, notice a little bit of green kind of speckled on the map throughout the afternoon. Chances for a few light rain showers south of the metro, closer to the parkways. Again, just a chance. It won't be widespread or heavy, but just know, again, if you reside south of the metro, yeah, you have a chance for a light shower, mainly tomorrow afternoon. Otherwise, those temperatures, nice and pleasant again as we're looking at upper 60s for the most part. Farther north you go, more in the way of sunshine, you have a better chance of hitting that 70 degree mark once again. I think everybody will be well into the 70s and dancing for joy on St. Patrick's Day Thursday. My goodness, does it look to be a beautiful day with partly to mostly sunny skies, temperatures throughout the region reaching the low and also the mid 70s, folks. That is well above average. If by chance you are heading northbound to Indy, as both UK and Murray State will be playing basketball, of course, in the NCAA tourney, the road to the Final Four, Thursday evening, weather up in Indianapolis during the day Thursday. Picture perfect. Lots of sunshine and pleasant there as well. Temperatures in the low 70s, northbound and high 65. Wow. Here's our forecast. Few high clouds, quiet and pleasant this evening. 60s will bounce back into the 50s. During the day tomorrow, those clouds will be thickening. We'll go mainly cloudy through the afternoon. Your high 69. And don't be surprised if there's a couple of light showers, especially south of the metro. St. Patrick's Day, nice, a lot of sun, 75. A better chance for more widespread yet scattered showers in here Friday, 67. A couple of those could linger into Saturday. Saturday's a cooler day. We're at 55 with mostly cloudy skies. Spring arrives Sunday, a little after 11.30 in the morning, Vicki. Comes in nice with mid-60s, and we're back to 70 again. Monday of next week. Boy, that's a good-looking seven-day forecast. A couple of rain chances, but it's March, right? It's going to be beautiful weather until Derby. Boy, I wish, right? <laughs> it would be drop, great right? to keep this going. It looks really